the Isle of Mull, just 12 miles off the west coast of Scotland, and just a short ferry ride from Oban. Mull is an island full of wildlife and was my home for many years. I have come home to Mull in the hope of filming one of the island's most elusive and alluring mammals. I have come home in search of otters. The Isle of Mull is surrounded by the Atlantic Ocean and the seas around Mull are some of the richest in the UK. Full of life, the strong Atlantic currents push nutrients to the surface creating the perfect feeding ground for otters and they are thriving on the island. When I lived on the island I spent much of my time searching for otters and soon grew to understand the habits of these majestic creatures. Otters are, however, notoriously shy, preferring to avoid the company of humans and they are very hard to find. Although otters don't have the best eyesight, they have a keen sense of smell and will often have hidden before you have any chance of seeing them. And with only a week on the island to find and film the otters, I will need luck on my side and the weather to be kind. During my time on Mull, the weather has been unseasonably wild, with icy cold wintry showers blowing in from the north making finding the otters a challenge. I explored mile after mile of the island's rugged coastline, and day after day the rain poured and the wind blew. One day, cold and wet, hidden behind a rock, I thought to myself, if I was an otter, I would be tucked up in my hold, warm and cosy, and I'm sure they were. My time on the island was running out, but just as I was beginning to lose hope, the telltale signs, a rustle in the kelp, the flash of a tail disappearing behind the rocks, a brief splash in the water, and for just a few brief moments, a fleeting glimpse of an otter, before the rain sent him scurrying off home again. Sadly, my time on the island has now come to an end, but I will return home again soon in search of otters. <laughs> <laughs>